it's me, Salem Mars Ray here, and today I and today I have to talk, and today I'm going to talk about. Well, what am I going to talk about? So, in a Salem Moon followership, they always want to talk about this one thing about the hate that have the hate that folks have for you know Deke and Cloverway and Pioneer and the love they have for Viz. Now, I could always keep on making films talking about this and never truly understand the hate or where it came from. But first off, let me tell you something I haven't bitched in a long time about something. So, first off, you got these folks who bitched about, oh, they bitched about about all the things I didn't like about Deke and didn't like about Pioneer, I guess Pathseeker, right? Or Cloverway. And for what grounds? Here are the things that they bitch about that you would say was not a big deal. Two followings becoming one following becoming one. Yeah, these folks made a big deal out of Deke taking what was one following and making two followings out of it. Yeah, they bitched about that. Oh, Day of, De Day of Destiny or Day of Ending or whatever you want to call it. Oh, well that should have been one following. Oh no, it's two followings. Well, why bitch about that? You should be thankful you got those two followings. Then you would have one more, gr then you would have then you'd be happy to see the last following. But no, you folks want to see, were mad that Deke made one following and made it into two. Then, you bitch about the names. Yeah, oh my God, you bitched about the names being shifted. Oh, I don't like these Greek or Hellene or Latin or French or whatever English name. Uh, I don't like these Latin or Greek or or French borrowed names. Oh no, I want the Don Landish borrowed names. Make a big deal about Serena, uh, about, it's about a big deal about Serena being Serena and not Usagi. A big deal about Amy not being Imi. Me, I, I, my, my name kept the same. Oh, Lita not being Makofo, and Mina not being Minako, and Rini not being Chibaluza, give me a break for all the things to bitch about, and you're going to bitch about names. Yes, they were borrowed names, but once again, they were borrowed names that folks who speak English would understand. You're not dealing, I mean, keep in mind, Deacon Cloverway made Sailor Moon for a younger, for younger children at the time. Tw you know, kids, tweens, whatever. Not folks like you. I mean, not for grown-ups, whatever. At the time, Deke did make it for kids. So, I don't think every kid in the world spoke more than one speech. So yeah, they were going to shift the Don Landish names and give them names that were borrowed, yes, but names that English folk, folks who spoke English would understand. Then, here's another thing you bitched about. Yeah, you then, yeah, you then bitched about it being in English. Oh my God, yeah. Forbid that it be in a speech that you speak and you understand. Oh, it's folks are too lazy to learn another speech. Well, a lot of kids and tweens that were watching Sailor Moon when it first came out, well, in the in the Wanted Rikes and and Settle Land, nine between ninety five YL, would only be speaking one speech. That would be English. All right. So why bitch about it being in a speech that you speak? I don't get it. I do not get it. And then you bitching about the sailor says thing. Yeah, I know. 
it was funny, I know, but keep in mind, all Farseer folk works at the time had to have children learning on. So the only way that Deke and everyone else that was putting out stuff to follow the oversight that the FCC came up with at the time was they had to put Sailor Says. You're going to bitch about that? Well, you know what? Sonic had it too. Did you bitch about that too? And then you bitched about the show players. The ones that did the speaking for them. Oh, I, I, I don't like the way they speak. That's not the way I mind see them speaking like. How did you mind see them speaking like? Speaking Don Landis English? Forgive me if they were speaking New World English or Settled Land English. What are about the saying? They're about the same. But forgive me, they were speaking English and you didn't think they spoke it right. And what's all this? What's this? All of this sad on look, all this shameful on look for Viz. Oh, Viz is the one that did it right. We should have gotten this back in the day. Oh yeah, you're going to get on Viz's bandwagon and say they're great. Well, you spent time bitching about Deacon Cloverway back in the day. Grow up, all of you. You make a big deal out of out of things that other folks will make a big deal of. Next thing you bitched about before I end this film is you uh, bitched about with some of the fighting being taken out. Was it such a big deal not to see folks getting cut open? Oh yeah, I guess it was to you. And then you bitched about, oh, we don't got all these really shameful, funny stuff in it. Yeah, because it was made for younger kids at the time. All right. So grow up. Stop bitching about things about Sail the Moon. All right. So that's it. I had I hadn't bitched about something in some time. Anyway, if you like that, follow me over here at Sailor Moon for Life. Or watch the last film I made yesterday over here. I'm Sailor Mars Ray, and I'll see you later.